So just to recap fronts. <coughs> fronts are the edges of air masses. There's big blobs of air in the atmosphere. And then the edges of them is where we have fronts. And so the four different kinds of fronts. There's a cold front where cold air comes and crashes into warm air. We have a warm front where the warm air sneaks up on the cold air. Stationary front where two different air masses kind of bump up next to each other. Occluded front where three of them get spun together in a cyclone and we get a very complicated storm. But the question is, why does it matter? Why do we care about these edges of fronts? Well, look at this, la this link, current front movement in the United States. So in this map, this is showing you all the different fronts across, the nor across North America. I'll slide over so we can see more of it. And so this really is showing, this is the edges of air masses. And this is over time, we can see they're moving across and the Coriolis effect, they're generally moving from west to east. So all the storms that are here in, the, in California are heading eventually over to the east coast. This was the big, huge storm. Patricia is working its way up towards Florida and Texas. You can actually see that going all the way across. Here it goes, across Mexico, all the way up. So this is helping forecasters predict what's going on. But also the really most important thing is, where fronts, where you can see a front, that's where there's weather. There's not much going on in Arizona for most of this time because there's really not much, the fronts aren't going through that area. We care about fronts because that's where weather happens. It's going to be just kind of calm, regular day. Southern California, calm, regular day. But it's where the fronts happen. That's where we get storms. That's where we get clouds. That's where we get hurricanes. That's where we get tornadoes is whenever we have these kind of major fronts. So that's the most important thing. Why do we care about fronts? Because that's where weather happens.